Well, everybody, welcome back to Chad and Chill News. Let's get straight into the story, man. We're going to start with Rihanna, man. Now, Rihanna's home was broken into by a suspected stalker who allegedly spent 12 hours inside her home. Now, reports are saying that Rihanna wasn't in her home at the, at the time that this took place in her Hollywood Hills home. And, you know, can you believe that this guy really just pulled up in the yard? Now, he's been cool climbing over the fence, into the yard, chilling. Um... To this, to, to my knowledge right now, as far as the stories have been told, as it's very new right now, nothing has been stolen and nothing really got touched up. Um, however, I wouldn't be surprised if he was trying to smell some of those panties, though, you know what I mean? <laughs> I know what you mean. <laughs> I know he was up in that bra section, nicker section, getting it home with some Rihanna sensation up there. Probably went down the laundry as well to smell some. Yours panties. <laughs> Some people got fetishes like that, you know. <laughs> don't, don't be surprised. Now, my man Edward de Leon is the guy who um, allegedly broke into the house. Um, he has been charged with stalking, first degree uh, residential burglary, and also restricting, uh, resisting arrest. So he obviously didn't want to be arrested, obviously. And vandalism, obviously. Vandalism. You've got to be caught for vandalism. Now, I want to go a bit further away from just, you know, uh, stalking. You know, stalking, you don't have to be famous to be a stalker. However, before I go into that, he could face up to six years in prison, um, which is a, a very, very long time, if you if you ask me. Um, does he deserve it? Yeah, I, I'll probably give it to him. I mean, I think it's 2018, um, and, you know, you got a lot of these movements now. I feel like I'm always bringing it up, but... Stalking is something that's very, 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 very uh, not really talked about much. You know, you hear a lot about, you know, things like rape and sexual harassment and I don't know, you hear a lot of things. A lot of people do get stalked. Now, this is a big shout out to everyone who's an Instagram model out here or, you know, you're, you're very popular on Instagram, but not necessarily a celebrity, but you might have like 50,000 followers. These people might envy you to... Uh, on a certain level that you would never know that people you know they fantasize over you they might wank over your pictures it, it, it's just a real it's just a realization of the situation um girls you got to be careful a lot of girls got to be careful what they're floor on, on social media i think that's what i'm trying to say here um men some men unfortunately are very weird um they will stalk you they will follow you they will find you you know, there's a thing called uh, in Instagram map where you could take a picture. If you take a picture two minutes ago, they will know exactly where your location is at. If you're putting in the location on your picture, they'll just roll up, pull up and try and find you. Um, you know, Snapchat now has got the, the new thing where you can kind of see their location too. So you've got to be very careful now how you kind of move on social media. Uh, me personally, I don't really tag where I'm at unless... I'm posting a picture two, three days later, but I'm not really popular. I don't think girls really care about me. I, I, I don't see no girls chasing moi. But, um, yeah, man, I do hope that a lot of you guys do stay safe, stay careful, free. Make sure you are with your people, though. Make sure, you know, you're not alone at night at, like, 3, 4 a.m. This is not safe in the streets. Catch an Uber. You get me? Uber it around, you know, if you're too intoxicated to drive your home yourself. Uh, just stay safe and stay safe and keep staying safe. So salute to Rihanna. Hopefully she's all right. Hopefully her home can, you know, gain a bit more security. Hopefully other girls stay safe on the street. My name is Cherie. People know me as Faraz. You know what I'm saying? You can catch me every single day dropping some more news. You've done already. I'm out. Hey, oh, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. What do you think of the situation, man? Does he deserve six years or does he deserve less? I don't know. You tell me. Because I don't know. I mean, six years, he thinks to take that six years. But the stalking game right now, social media, man, is on the roof. Peace.